here we're at the alarm control panel we're in the master bedroom closet upstairs uh, you can see I removed the cover to the alarm panel um, there were some notes left over by the installer in terms of where each of these wires went but uh, just some background on the house it has a pre-installed wired alarm system so the majority of the windows all the main doors all have uh, sensors that are going to them they're all uh, drilled inside the frame of the doors uh, you can't see them it looks really nice because you can't see them um, as a result I didn't want to buy a bunch of Z-Wave sensors and just stick them up on the doors when I could utilize the current system so I'm going to show you a little bit about the Z-Wave door sensor I have here I'll put a link in the description um, it will be an affiliate link see if I can make a couple bucks off this video but um, yeah if you buy the sensor it'll give me a tiny kickback from Amazon but um, it's a specific door sensor because there are many door sensors that don't have it I'll show you that just here in a second what the terminals look like but basically what it allows is for you to connect um, the existing wiring so this is going to my front door um, I'm trying to see if this is a note I went ahead and labeled them all so I'll be adding sensors to them um, but currently this one goes to the front door and I'll show you when I open it up here in just a second how that looks again this allows the magnets that are inside the front door when the doors open and shut uh, for it to communicate to the sensor which then communicates to smart things and um, I'll put an overlay of what my smart things app looks like when the front door opens and closes but it ba basically acts exactly like a normal alarm system but it utilizes the existing wiring that's already running throughout the house so just a second I'll go and crack open the z-wave sensor so you can see what that looks like so here's the sensor with the top removed as you can see there's the terminal right there I think it's in pairing mode when the top is removed um, so just ignore that light but uh, as you can see I just put the wires right into the terminals I don't even think it mattered to just stick one in one and the uh, one in another and and it works um, I've had this I did start this out about a year ago I, I'm gonna be adding more uh, to the system but um, battery's been good still says I have a lot of battery life and it's worked really well so again just a one idea to help you maybe repurpose your current system and, and use smart things and I'll show in some of the follow-up videos uh, some of what I did um, as it relates to an alarm panel um, just basically one of the things that uh, outside of the devices that are just around the house we got an Amazon Fire tablet 7-inch tablet and then we purchased an app called uh, Action Tiles which works with smart things hub and it has a place where you can kind of view all your sensors activities and arm and disarm alarm systems in future videos I'll show you um, my siren kind of the delays and how things work but um, this is just kind of the first video to kind of show uh, maybe not the brains but the uh, nerves of the system um, so anyways Hope you enjoyed. Um, I'll try to crank out the other videos in the coming days. But feel free to ask any questions you have in the comment section.